Ah, this is a nice day, isn't it, Marie? Just sit out here in the nice outside, not a care in the world. I guess, but it's so hot out here. I'm burning up, Callie. I, I might get cooked if I stay out here any longer. Come on, Marie. We barely go outside or do things like this. I'm sure it's not that hot. I... I don't know. I, uh, if you don't mind, I'm just gonna go inside for a minute and cool off. I'll maybe come back out here. All right. Ah, finally, a nice cold bath ready for me. Hmm. Seems like it's missing something though. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can bring my banjo with me. That way I can sing in the tub. Is that normal? Oh well, time to get my banjo and sing some Rainbow Connection in the tub. Whoa! Hot. Hot. It's cool in here. Is that a tub of water? Oh, that is water. Oh, I don't want to fall in there because that could be dangerous. Whoa. Whoa, 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 <laughs> yeah! Marie? No, no, that couldn't have been Marie. It just couldn't. Marie? She's been here, but. The water. No, it, Marie, no. It, no, it's. Uh, not, not possible. <laughs> Dang it, I couldn't find my banjo. I. Um. Oh, I. I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> Why? Oh, hey, Callie, what's up? <laughs> Go away, Candace. I'm not in the mood to talk right now. Is there something wrong? You seem depressed. Well, I am depressed, but I still don't want to talk about it. Hmm. Well, my best advice for you would be probably go talk to a therapist. Yeah, therapist. One's probably miles away. Not exactly. There's actually one here. R really? Yeah. I talked with him for a while and he helped me overcome my addiction to Sonic. Well, I'll see if he can help me. There, see? That wasn't so hard. Hello, Candace. Where's the therapist? He should have been here by now. Hello! I apologize for being late, but uh, I am here now to help you with your problem. Je Jeffrey the Giraffe? I have to sustain myself somehow. Eh, whatever. It doesn't really matter. So I understand that you're a bit depressed. Is there any reason why? I, I don't feel comfortable talking about it. Come on, I'm here to help you. You can trust me. You can tell me anything. Otherwise, we won't get to the bottom of this depression. Well, the truth is, I don't even know if it happened really or not, but I'm pretty sure Marie died in the bathtub. How? I heard her getting splatted, and when I came in, she wasn't there in the water, and I'm convinced she's gone forever. It's my fault. Oh dear, that is rather heavy. Well, Callie, we all have to deal with loss sometimes. Look at me, I had to deal with the loss of Toys R Us, and now I'm a therapist. But eventually, we come around. 
the best thing for you right now would be to seek support from friends and anyone else you can. But, but Mr. Giraffe, we're the Squid Sisters. How can you have the Squid Sisters with only one? Listen, I know you're upset. Right now I'd advise you probably get some rest. Just rest and hopefully you'll feel better soon. That's all I really know to do. Well, I'll, I'll try. Th thank you for your help. And I'm sorry about the loss of Toys R Us. Oh, it's fine, it's fine. So, Finn, you're certain that this drawing you're gonna do is gonna look just like me? Absolutely, Jake. I would never snub my best buddy like that. Okay, Patrick, are you ready to make this energy patty? Oh, yeah, I am, because I'm with my best friend. Okay. But why won't you let me over to the Pac-Man plug-and-play, Luigi? You know what that thing does to you, Mario. Besides, I'm protecting you. It's what a good brother does. I, I guess you're right. <laughs> Hello there, Callie. I was just dropping by to see how you're doing. But I hope you get better. I know what it feels like to lose someone very close to you. It's not a fun feeling. But if you need us, we'll be here for you. Feel better soon. Hey, Callie. It's Snoopy. Really sorry to hear about you losing Marie. I really hope you feel better. I decided to come and see you because, well... I was pretty much the first person you spoke to here, and it makes me upset to see you this sad. I'll be cheer up soon. Well, Marie, I don't know if we'll ever be happy again. <laughs> snack or something. <sighs> what is there? Fudge rounds. Maybe this one. If I like could share one with Marie. <laughs> Marie, please. <laughs> Why? <laughs> what was that? Callie. Oh no, it's, it must be some kind of monster. I, I gotta get out of here. Callie, come here. Stop running. Come out wherever you are. Callie. No, 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 go away. I'm a goner if I don't think of something. I have no choice. Callie. I'm through running, monster. Callie, Callie, stop. Stay, stay back. Callie, stop. Yes, Callie, it's me. Now put away the knife, and let's go talk right now. So, Callie, care to explain what exactly motivated you to pull a knife on me and try to stab me? Do you know how close that came to my face? Why would you ever do that? I didn't mean to. I didn't know it was you in the dark. I... I thought you were dead. Dead? How did you think I was dead? 
A few hours ago, when you went inside, I, I heard the noise of an inkling getting splatted, and when I came and saw a big bathtub full of water, you were gone. <sighs> Kelly, you need to not jump to conclusions like that. What do you mean? I mean, I did make the splat noise, but I got out of the tub, ran to the dryer, spent a couple hours in there getting all nice and dry again, and then when I came out, I heard you were in the utility room, so I decided, oh, well, I'll go and say hello to Callie. But instead, you ran from me, and then when I found you again, you pulled a knife. You didn't die, but I thought Inklings were water intolerant. Maybe in the games, but th does this look like a game, Callie? No. Exactly. This is real life. Why else do you think I was washing my hands last Christmas, or we went to the beach with Mario, where there's an ocean? I, that's a good point. I didn't think of that. Oh, I'm sorry, Marie. I feel like a massive idiot for everything I've done today. <sighs> Kelly, you may be clumsy sometimes, but you're not an idiot. In fact, knowing that you worry that much about me reassures me in some way, but uh, next time please get all the facts before you jump to a conclusion like that. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll make sure of that in the future. I think now we should both be uh, getting to bed. Well said, well said. You know, Marie, I'm glad things are back to normal. Yeah. Ooh, getting kind of hungry. Excuse me, I'm going to go to the kitchen real quick. Okay. There ought to be food around here somewhere. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Not again. What? Marie? That noise could have only come from the garbage disposal. No. No. Not again, no. <laughs> gotcha. What? You jumped to conclusions. Again. Well played. Very well played.